You know, during the history of Combat Corner, it's kind of crazy looking back. We started, you know, just an idea of a retail store. We were gonna sell, distribute martial arts and boxing related products from other brands. We had no budget. So really the first place we found was the, the most affordable place, which was this little 750 square foot building. Nine months later, we realized that building was a little too small. We moved into the next building, which was 2,500 square feet. We stayed there for five years. We had to decide who we were. We continued as a retailer. We slowly started morphing into a brand who was making and manufacturing its own products. And by the end of that period at that facility of five years, it was clear that we needed to focus on our own brands and stop carrying other brands. So at that point, we moved into our third facility and we stayed there for about 18 months. Our next facility we moved into was about 10,000 square feet. We stayed there for about six years. It was a great building and beautiful location in Menominee Falls, Wisconsin, right next door to Coles Corporate. It was a great experience being there, but it was time to move. It was time to own our own building. That building we had leased, all the previous buildings we had leased. So we began a hunt um, to look for the proper building that would facilitate our current needs and growth, but one we could also buy. So after about a year and a half of looking, and multiple offers, multiple failed deals, we finally found a building that was going to work well for us. It was a 30,000 square foot facility in Milwaukee, Wisconsin, bringing us back to our roots really in Milwaukee. We basically gutted the whole facility. We took everything out and we went at it from scratch. Built out all the showroom, the offices, all the finishes, the walls, the carpets, the paint, the fixtures, everything. In the warehouse, we refinished and painted the warehouse to bring it up so it had the right atmosphere, feel, and look for what we were doing in this building. Finally, after doing all the landscaping and doing the exterior paint to make the building look great from the outside, we had about a 3,800 square foot area that we had been contemplating making a gym or using for other purposes. And we decided to move forward with the gym when we had worked out a deal to host a great organization that takes place in Milwaukee that's called City Champs, which is a nonprofit that allows kids that can't normally afford martial arts training to get instruction from quality coaches for free. So we worked out a deal for, to host them and to have their organization use our facility. So we built out the gym. So now we have a 3,800 square foot gym that is really pretty awesome. Additionally, we're going to be using that space for seminars, for camps, for open mats. Also, our staff loves to train there in the morning. So it just turned out to be a beautiful spot. And then finally, our exterior space. I won't touch on that too much, but our plans are to eventually hold and host live events in our outdoor space, giving us a true vertically integrated solution where we have you know, a retail showroom. We have production capabilities in our facility. We have warehousing and distribution capabilities in our warehouse. We have a gym where we can do all of our testing, R&D, all of our photo shoots, videos, content collection, as well as an event space to allow people who are doing all those things to put it to the test and also capture all of that so people can consume it. People can eat, breathe, and sleep combat corner. So that was our goal here.